Okay, so today I'm pretty excited to show you my latest and greatest. Uh, while some of my fellow YouTubers have been building an observatory, I couldn't get permission from the boss. But I've gone for the next best thing, a permanent pier. So one of the issues with having a big telescope and uh, a big mount like the AZ EQ6 is the weight. The tube on its own is 13 kilos, the counterweights are 15 kilos, the head is another uh, 9 kilos, the tripod's 7 kilos. That means 3, 4, 5 trips and then you've got all the electronics and everything else to set up as well. Okay, so let's go and have a look at it. Uh, it's down the end of the garden, which is not a bad place for it. Um, it would have been a good place for an observatory as well. So yeah, patio area would have been good. Uh, nice view off to the east and south. And here's the, uh, the pier. It's a uh, reinforced drainage pipe filled with concrete and uh, right into the ground with reinforcing rods as well. So, uh, yeah, homemade pier adapter on the top and the AZ EQ6 GT. Here's a quick demonstration of the setup. A little bit too quick, to be honest. Okay, so start with a hole and it needs to be at least two feet deep. Uh, I'd got an area of the garden with a tree in it so I started to dig it out and then used a hole spade to go right down the uh, two foot or so and uh, then I used a um, reinforcing bar inside the hole. Here's the drainage pipe also cut to size and they are one meter uh, reinforcing rods driven in more than half their length. Okay, so you have to measure up the uh, mount head to make the pier adapter. Lots of measurements, um, make a drawing up and then have a brother-in-law with a workshop that can turn out some nice bits of aluminium. Assemble it all together, looks good. Decided to use some longer bolts. Then uh, some stuff to calculate how much cement and concrete I would need. Online calculators, worked out to be seven bags support the tube, make sure it's upright the bit of wood gives me some space to get my hand underneath to tighten up find some mates with a cement mixer fill the hole first of all or fill the center first and then the hole keep going until you get to the top um, put the mount head adapter plate in there and sink the bolts right down, they'll all set quite nicely and uh, yeah you can see it was marked with north there so that I could get the alignment for Pol Polaris set up uh, permanently later on. Here it is finished with a telescope, looking really good. Got some stones around the bottom, a little bit of work to do on the plants, etc. Got a cover, and uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you soon.